exercise adrenaline. Oh, pushing the boundaries. <sighs> Adventure. And it's really not as hard as it looks. In fact, I'm going to show you the easy way to bring all the fun of the climbing wall back to your place. And I do believe I found the perfect place for it. The corner of this rumpus room is going to be ideal. There'll be an explosion of colour the kids can have fun with for hours. First up, we've got to clear some space. Then trim three sheets of 19mm ply. Before a quick undercoat. I'm using this ply to line the walls of the rumpus room. Now, the reason for that is to recreate those ply walls we saw earlier in the climbing gym. They give you freedom to place your climbing mounts wherever you like, especially if you're going to a stud wall, and it's a lot easier to do so. I'll just let all these dry, then shift them inside. Because there'll be kids climbing all over it, it is pretty important to make sure that the ply is fixed securely to the wall. Now, if you're going to a stud wall, First, put the sheet into its finished position. Then mark the edge of the sheet. Then pull it away and measure back along the wall to where you find a stud. Here, they're 600 millimetres apart. Use that same measurement from the edge of your sheet to tell you exactly where your screws need to go. I'm putting a row of screws in every stud at the top, middle and bottom of the sheet. This adjacent wall is all masonry, which makes life easy because I can screw into it anywhere. There's no power in this wall, but it's important you know whether there's power in yours and if there is, where the cables go so you don't screw into them. I'm using masonry screws for this, which means no need for plugs. You'll find you may need a couple extra screws at the joins, anywhere where you've got a little bit of flex going on. Now for the climbing holes. These are a cast resin. You can pick them up from climbing stores and they come in a lot of different colours. That's so you can plan different climbs on the wall. Say red could be very hard, yellow could be dead easy. You want the highest one to be about 600 millimetres taller than your child. That way they can do what's called a traverse climb, where they go sideways around the wall without a harness. <laughs> How good is this? All right, that's one, 100 to go. The beauty of attaching these climbing holds to ply sheet is that you can move things around as much as you like really easily. This one can go there, that one can go there. You can change the game in seconds. Some foam matting will make the landing softer for your indoor adventure. There's one climbing wall done and dusted. Now all it needs is some serious testing out. Come on, kids. I really love it. Can I have a go? Sure thing. Jump up. There we go. Oh, try any colour, really. <laughs> Challenge upon challenge and hours and hours of fun. Yeah. 